in, in, in a biological sense, where life begins is a little bit up for debate, right? I mean, like, if you ask right. a scientist, they'll probably tell you, well, that, that's a philosophical and a theological question, right? When life begins. And in some ways, it's also the wrong question to be asking in situations like this. Because when life begins is a little bit ethereal, the legal question that is really driving a lot of this is when does personhood begin? Legally, right. when does a person become a person that can lay claim to certain rights, right? And that that's the, the right, because you, you could believe that life begins at conception in some philosophical sense, but then say like, but that's just a cluster of living cells. That's not a person, right? And so that, that, that's right. really where this debate is playing out. And part of what was so radical about this Alabama uh, Supreme Court ruling was that it, it did attribute personhood and, and they called them extra uterine people, right? Like,